<laughs> wala pa pala akong lipstick. Ooh. Hello everyone! Happy and blessed Sunday to all of you and I hope you're having a good day with your family. It's a good day outside, the sun is out, the sky is blue, the birds are singing. And I thought it's a good day to vlog. And if you're new here, hi, I'm Mary. Nice to meet you and welcome to my channel. But it's a good day to do a vlog today. And it's a perfect timing as well because I want to do flip my old clothes into something that I am really into recently, which is this stuff. So what I like about this kinds of tops is you can basically pair this with any bottoms that you have, be it jeans, mom or boyfriend jeans, skirts, shorts, or whatever bottoms that you have in your closet. And it's very hassle-free for me, especially pag tamad akong maghanap ng anong, kung anong susuotin ko or tamad akong mag-bear up ng mga coordinates. This is actually my go-to top recently. If you want to exercise your creativity at home, you can basically do this at home or make this at home. Especially um, if you have old clothes that you're not wearing anymore, so might as well turn it into something useful. Also, I have some clothes that needs touching up, so I might do that as well in this video. If you want to know and want to see how I make this stuff, please keep on watching and please don't forget to hit the thumbs up down below and might as well subscribe on my channel so you'll get notified whenever I upload new videos. So without further ado, let's start flipping! To start, I'm going to use the white top that I wore earlier, which I got from Shein. I'm sorry if I mispronounced that, but anyways, I'm gonna use it as my guide and add at least 1-2 to two inches from each measurement for the seam allowances. And I measured 13 inch for the top part and 9 inch for the length. Then, cut, cut, cut! forget to cut one side of the sandal for later. Now for the strap, I'm going to mark the fabric using the length measurement of the strap from the white top. And don't forget to pin everything since this kind of fabric moves a lot.
Just to make sure to have a good finish, I'm going to draw a straight line. And of course, cut, cut, cut! If any of you are wondering where I got this portable sewing machine, I actually bought this from Shopee for a very affordable price. And recently, if any of you are watching who know me, we were affected, greatly affected by flood here in our city and nabaha siya guys. Marami siyang putik, may mga putik-putik to nilinis ko lang and surprisingly, gumagana pa rin siya. This is very good for its price. It does the work for you. Now we're going to saw the edges of this. So always, always remember na yung thread is on the wrong side. Let's see kung gumaganda siya. Kumuha yung pahiya, please. Okay, let's try, let's try, let's try. Ang hirap pa naman ito. Eh? Oh! Oh, dahil hindi siya gumagod. Eh! Uh. Guys, basically, ito lang ang pag tahi ng strap. So, I'm gonna do this with the other three remaining straps. So, I'm done with the two straps that I'm going to use. And now, I'm going to show you the technique that I do to flip this wrong side of the fabric into the right side of the fabric. So, on this technique, you will be needing two things. Either a straw or a stick. Yung sa straw, pwede kayo gumawa itong maliit na butas. Pero, wala ako nun. Ito lang yung meron ako. So, so what I'm going to do is this. Ito yung wrong side of the fabric. And, ito yung end part. Ang gagawin ko lang is ipapasok. Eh, hindi ko siya ipapasok sa butas. Gagawin ko lang siyang panulak. Like this. Like this. Mabilis na siya gawin and I'll be right back. Gagawin ko lang yung ibang strap. And then, tatahin na tayo ng top na mismo. And don't forget to close the other end side of the strap. Then, I'm going to fold at least half an inch for the same allowances to both top and the bottom part. Now it's time to attach the straps onto the top.
don't forget to cut excess fabric for a clean finish. For this specific top, I'm going to put pearls on it, which were from my broken pearl necklace. Like I said, might as well make use out of it. So now, I just positioned the pearls on how I wanted it to look like. Tapos ko, tinahi ko lang yung mga pearls kung saan ko sila gusto ilagay. And there are a lot of styles you can do with this. And depende na yun sa inyo. But for me, I prefer na spread out lang sila. And now, we're going to continue putting more pearls. <music> 